Who are you? What's up, y'all? I'm the Pudzadik. Salam, my name is Shakespeare, a full fledged MC from Bombay. My name is Infamous, also known as Hitain Sangani. What's up? My name is The Evo, rapping Mumbai City. I'm a battle rapper and I'm also an artist. From freestyling to releasing tracks to performing and from battling, I've done all. I'm from the Crew Monkey Rhymes and I've been rapping since 2008, 2007. Uh, I'm one of the old school breeds, uh, the Insignians. Uh, we started around what, 08, 09, something like that. We built our foundations right from text battling up, we moved on to audios, we moved on to the real thing, on stage, doing that thing. And it's been six to seven years that I'm doing this. I started back in like 2008 and from this it's, it has been a gradual process of learning. I'm still learning but I'm at some point where I can say that yeah, I can take on some people. I started battling as a text battler in Insignia and then I've st I started battling live in college events etc since 2009 or something and my last battle was 2010 or 11 I don't remember and after that this is my first battle. Uh, for the past couple of years I was, I was into um, trying to bring uh, the, the Delhi hip hop scene back to life so uh, I, I, I wasn't focusing much on my own stuff and I'm always looking forward to some battles and I've always been a fan of battle rap but now, uh, ever since I moved to Mumbai about six months ago, I've really, I've really been trying to get back into the game. So, just, just so excited for this. Well, yeah, EMF. Since the time this battle has been announced, I've hated him. I've seen him battle Sai the Slick Tip and he basically slaughtered him. Well, I haven't had the time to check out Brotherhood stuff, uh, honestly, because I've been, I've been really caught up with shit here uh, in my own life. I've hated him a lot, but but I hear he's been making waves. He's been doing some really crazy stuff in the underground. So I I really look forward to battling him, and I hope we both bring our A games. My next opponent is Slick Tip. Man, I have seen him battling in a couple of battles, from uh, the culture battles to the underground rap battles. And that was basically a one-sided match. But this is like this is a two-edged sword, my buddy. And this time, there are going to be a lot of bars, man, a lot of bars. I've seen that guy grow. He's got some punches, he's got bars, but the thing is, what he lacks is experience that matters a lot in these battles. It takes a lot in last battle, he choked up. So that, that's kind of weakness, weak points that he has, and he need to work on that shit. I hate him, I don't like his hair. I don't like his funny pants. Man, I've been taking MCs like that, man. I've been four-time monster battle champion. Not bragging, but it takes a lot. If you can just be there and say that, yeah, it's easy to uh, battle rap, freestyle, go up the dome and step in a battle. It's very easy. This guy got cheesy rounds and stuff. But when you actually step in a battle and you try to battle and that time your mind doesn't work sometimes, but still you got to pull it out from your, within yourself, that takes a lot. Battle rap is not an easy at all. It, it takes a lot of skills, potential and everything. You know what I'm saying? And before I say something about eccentric, I want to get this shit off my chest. I said some shit about A-list in my previous battle, but this time there ain't going to be no gimmick no more. This is just going to be bars. B-A-R-S. That's it. You better bring a whole pack of bars, eccentric, because, because this time it's not side the slick tip. It's me. And I'm not going to choke. And, you know, sometimes his jokes are really fucked up, you know. And I'm telling you this. My jokes are more fucked up, man. Look, I'm prepared. I'm prepared. That's it. Uh, next battle, uh, it's like it's like when I step in a battle, my, my mindset is more similar to like a gladiator when he steps in a Coliseum, man. He just want to go there and just live like it's his last fight or something like that. It's do or die situation. So when I'm in a battle, I make sure that I'm punching whoever in front of me. I'm gonna bring jokes. I hate him. I'm gonna bring personal things. And it's gonna be bars more of jokes. Man. I, I, I might say because uh, I, I study my opponent a lot when I that's kind of homework that I do so it's gonna be more of personal things and I'm really looking forward to this battle uh, B3 has come up with this initiative the and it's their title civil war so it's gonna be really gruesome it's gonna be bombardment and it's gonna be explosion and you're gonna love that shit well I, I think we're both gonna go in hard so that's pretty much that's pretty much all I can say but I have a gut feeling I'm gonna fuck this guy up. This matchup is gonna be epic because I know for the fact that Eccentric is a hard worker and uh, last time he brought bars, I'm gonna bring bars 
basically as you can see in this entire interview i'm just saying bars 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 and that's all you're going to see in that battle man so just tune into b3 and you'll see a hell lot of bars man i don't know what to expect but i'm just going to try to put in the best bars that i can come up with against emf because uh, he's been acting like an asshole lately so i've been getting like urges to kill him even more but yeah i'm also expecting a lot of good bars from him he's a really good battler you know i was i'm like kind of nervous to battling him because i've seen him battle and the way he rides you know he's pretty good takkar ka aadmi i've been hearing stuff and you know you you hear things and some of them some of them are good some of them are not so good but really it depends on who it's coming from so uh, taking that into account as well as the fact that my the, the last battle i had with emf was really a confidence booster that was that was a really great battle so i'm really pumped up for this one so you know i'm excited but you know, i'm going to take my dick out as a sword and slap him and you're going to love that shit the next person i want to battle is uh, unlike emf i'm not looking out for as or anyone uh, basically anyone who wants to battle me is free to choose i'm not the guy who's going to tell you or put you down because your level is low or some like that i'm just going to go for the kill with whoever you are whether you're from nala supara whether you're from daisha whether you're from uh, bhimandi i don't fucking care you're dead to me battle next uh i don't know man i'm just going to keep it on the down low when it comes to battle for the next few years i guess because battle is a lot of stress for me since i'm coming out with solo stuff now so keeping up with a battle and it's kind of stressful but if i get a chance to do a like a on the spot freestyle battle <coughs> or something i'm up for that anybody anybody but off the dome man not pre written it's a lot of pressure uh, i've been in the scene for like 7 years i've been seeing people battle they are uh, honestly speaking i think the amount of like uh, battle rappers sick battle rappers are there in bombay i don't th- i don't think any other city has that we got poetic justice we got emf uh, eccentric is sick sick his new cat and he's got sick rhymes on core i want to see all these guys battle and there's nothing like i got beef or something i really want to step up to them i i want to like battle them and try and learn something and at the same time let the game like elevate from where it is right now you know what i'm saying that's it well um there are a lot of people like i've just joined bombay so like these fuckers have been battling each other for years now but i'm new to the scene so i love to battle each and every one of them but all i'll say is stay tuned and you're going to see you're going to see who i'm who i'm going to want to battle next